Here we have the PB Pro 101. It is uh, a uh, affordable comb binding machine. It punches up to 12 sheets of paper. Um, it, it has a front front accessed uh, chip drawer for easy access for emptying. Emptying has an adjustable margin guide so that you can set it to do 11 inch sheets, uh, the, the the 11 inch side, or you can adjust it over and do other sizes, mainly eight and a half by 11, by adjusting the margin guide. Um, it uh, it also has a depth guide which controls how deep the holes are punched in to the sheet and that's accessed right here in the back and uh, you don't need to change that often but if you are tight on a binding you can adjust the holes closer to the edge so you can fit a few more sheets in and the inner edge is of the paper won't hit each other as they lay open flat uh, so now I'm going to go ahead and start the demonstration I have here uh, approximately 12 sheets we're going to insert that slide it over to the guide now I've preset it already to 11 inches push down. It also has a nice U-shaped handle here so that you have good stability and, and it's easy to, to push down. So and here you have your holes for the comb binding. Then you insert your plastic comb into the top of the machine with the teeth up and you just insert it here and pull it open as such and you insert the pages over the teeth and voila lift it up and you've got a comb bound document we're going to adjust this guide real quick and we're going to do uh, more of a I guess a portrait style or we're going to do the eight and a half inch side now when you're punching clear covers you have a, we have a cover so we can't punch we're going to punch a less, lesser amount of sheets. It's always good to punch clear covers only one at a time with paper. It helps clear the blades. But you'll see here, there's a punch for the eight and a half inch side. I'll do the back cover. And there it is. And then we're going to take uh, and take a comb, and we're going to insert it up top here, and can you just insert just as such and release and, and then you just cut the binding with a pair of scissors right at the in this case we're going to use an exacto carefully uh, and you cut it to size you can pre-cut them with scissors but now you have a a document that's opening this way and then you have a nicely bound document from our PB Pro 101